let's start one interesting journey with Playwright and MCP server. You have probably prompt generate code in TypeScript or Python to automate in chat GPT and code got generated. Or maybe you have developed Python code using Agent AI. What about MCP server? So in the MCP server, you will prompt and then Playwright will generate the code. Let's explore and learn one important concept that is MCP and Playwright. So Playwright and model control protocol and using that particular combination, we can leverage the generative AI and generate the scripts automatically or execute scripts automatically. So this is the URL. Go to the GitHub of a Playwright MCP. Scroll down. So model control protocol server that provides browser automation capabilities using Playwright. The key features are mentioned and use cases, web navigation, form filling, automated testing, driven LLM, general purpose browser interaction for agents. And this is example config and installation in VS Code that we are going to use. And alternatively, you can also install Playwright using this particular settings. Okay. There are two versions. One is VS Code Insider and second one is VS Code. So first, to click on this particular uh, like VS Code Insider, we don't need VS Code Insider. Okay. So let's search for VS Code Insider, install the VS Code Insider. VS Code Insiders. This is the page to download VS Code Insider. VS Code Insider is like uh, actually uh, like VS Code only, but there are some development activities going on in always in the VS Code Insider. Okay. So this is latest uh, like features you will get. Click on download based on your operating system. I have already downloaded. I will just cross it. But it would be very simple uh, click to download it. Once you download it, it will um, for my laptop, it will come to download. Okay, but uh, I'll show you where exactly I extracted it. Once you download it, you know, like it will uh, go to your extracted, uh, like you need to extract it. Okay, unzip it. So once you unzip it, you can install it. So this is the place where actually this is the one for Insider. Earlier one is for VS Code. So it will be very easy. Just extract it and then install it. So uh, this is the launcher application launcher code insider launch it so it would be similar to our vs code only and this is our vs code insider so what you need over here you need uh, one thing let's close all open stuff the typescript files okay from here Okay, so what you need, we need v GitHub Copilot. Okay. So GitHub Copilot, search for that extension, install it. So for my case, this is already installed, but you know, like in the, in the left hand side, go to navigation ex extension and search for GitHub Copilot and install it. Once that installation done, you will see this top portion, right? At that one, GitHub Copilot chat. You can enable or disable this right hand pop up will come out okay so that's your setting so one thing you need vs code insider and second one you need github copilot okay now if we go back to our uh, github page where we like playwright mcp server github page click on this button okay installation in vs code that particular uh, one and then open our mcp server now you can see so configuration install server there are two uh, like uh, pop-up will appear okay so now if you go and then uh, like some settings.json file user setting json file will appear okay once you click on install server Okay, let me stop both the, uh, the like settings and then let's start it again. Okay, so this is the way you will also start. So if it is not installed, you will probably see uh, one like some log. Okay, in the terminal that few tools are getting installed. For me, 
all the tools are installed but in your case you may see some tools are getting installed okay so uh, but those are the buttons that you need to click okay to start the servers now now click on our uh, github copilot and from here from here click on this tool button okay 15 tools are already installed okay see browser navigate browser go back these are the defined tools are actually in this mcp server a play right mcp server right so mcp server is connected with this but those tools so mcp is nothing but a protocol to connect to tools in a different way so let's start and do something okay uh, this is one of the uh, script that I generated, uh, like uh, using MCP server. But we'll create, okay? We'll create one more, and then we'll see how to fix uh, the code also automatically with simple English language. So what I'm going to do over here, I'll just write one prompt that launch make my trip dot com and search for flight from CCU which is Kolkata okay to London for okay let's not give any uh, date over here right now and select cheapest flight price flight from the list let's run it okay so I'm sure it has already a make my trip script, so it will go in the make my trip test type strip file and try to update over there. So this is another intelligent level, right? Like, uh, so it will first look into your existing folder folder where the code is related code is there, and it will modify your code uh, in that particular file because it will understand that code is already present over there so i will just keep it just to show you the earlier code was working condition i don't know like what will happen over after it, uh, clicking on that keep button but this is not an production code so don't worry uh, you like let's go and then check our config file playwright config file okay make my trip test file is already mapped over here so i need to clear probably i don't know like why terminal is behaving little odd over here let's tear it okay okay anyway let's write npx playwright this is the command to run the test there are other ways also to run it but that's not our intention over here so our intention to see that particular english language generated code is actually working okay the pop-up getting closed kolkata london you can see that is getting like selected right that uh, those things yeah here maybe i need to go a little bit and then select the calendar because as i said for the cheapest flight so it was actually trying to find the cheapest flight from uh, the calendar itself anyway some network problem is there in make my trip that's not a uh, thing right okay anyway but our like in the very very first setup what we understood that with a simple english language where i ask uh, to launch make my trip select ccu and london and find a cheapest flight so i did not put any i have not written any simple code or anything a single line code but that's the beauty right that's what i just wanted to show you at the very first one let's try to play with nasdaq okay that would be i think interesting one at at least look into this one okay and we'll search for one symbol over here and uh, and the symbol we will be looking for suppose apple so here open the url and search for apple stock symbol okay that's it let's see how it works it started looking into it mcv server okay i will give permission to navigate that's cool nasdaq.com opened 
and uh, next i'm expecting apple symbol to search okay browser type that's good it will type apple over here yeah lovely so you can see apple symbol search and then this is the search page right and uh, yeah that's the thing i successfully searched for apple on the nasdaq website the search result includes the stock symbol apple okay i see which is apple i see common stock one okay that's uh, nice it could able to execute a one business process but what about code let's ask to generate code for the above navigation okay so you able to navigate it correctly let's do a task for me let's create a like code to automate navigation of the search for apple stock symbol on the nasdaq website use playwright i will create test scripts that's what i am looking for yes so now i want to keep it okay and you can see it able it generated in a like a file it did not like override make my tree because it's not related to make my tree right so i'll just keep it and now i will try to run this particular test i'll change to our config okay this is inside that's why i am not getting that particular uh, playwright extension to run it from that particular file anyway so this is our test type script file and we'll run the test over here and we are expecting to launch the browser nasdaq browser that's one and search for apple symbol okay some error yeah so this is one situation i could have like actually make it pass but i'm giving you uh, like uh, like i am trying to tell you that there are more than only generating scripts okay see the it is getting like why it is getting failed this is getting failed because of the cookies button okay i am thinking for cookies button only this is getting failed yeah see it get it, it's getting failed for the cookies one right accept all cookies now let's we, what we can do we can delete it manually or let's ask our like mcp server to delete it remove cookies code it started working on that particular uh, file applying edits 63% done 100% done see now if i click on keep i'm pretty sure that particular cookies code will get deleted that's what we are looking for right so that's the thing see not only generating the code but after generating the code if you think that certain things are not working fine or you want to modify certain piece of code you can ask uh in the mcp server playwright mcp server copilot and then that will automatically get changed right so one way it generates the code and second way it will actually fixing the code so now i'm expecting the result will show that pass okay again failed what is the reason uh, the reason is here i will show you one thing that it is actually thinking to have one url expected url okay to have url which is the last line so here everything you try to uh, do it with code or like not code with genai that's not a feasible solution or that will not give you uh, productivity high productivity also okay so that is what i wanted to show you also that for a single line of change if you just ask gen ai to delete one line that's not a like valid use case of gen ai okay because to have url expectation one just one like assertion i deleted it so that way 
I save entire generation of coding using MCP server. Instead of that, I rely on my skill and deleted that particular line. Now it will see that this got passed. Okay. So what I we have learned so far in this course, we have seen like this MCP server setup. We have uh, uh, like configured copilot we generated code and then also we like ask mcp to fix the code and again we with our skill we also deleted a certain line and understood like the reason when to use geni when to not to use geni for the fixing of code also okay so i hope you understood the mcp server of the playwright thank you